hovering above the nuclear silos. And what was happening was they didn't attack the nuclear silos. All they did was shut down. Uh, like Captain Robert Salas had like eight nuclear tip ICBMs. They all got shut down in rapid succession. And these systems have triple redundancy backup systems. So, and the uh, guards up top side were with their weapons drawn with a glowing red uh, saucer above the silo. And then the, uh, the UFO then went 60 miles to the other base and shut down their nuclear business as well. This has happened more than once. It's happened in uh, Brent Waters in the UK as well. What most people haven't heard came to me from two insiders, Bob Dean and Pete Peterson, where both of them independently told me that in the year 1990, all of the nuclear warheads in the U.S. and in the USSR completely melted down, became radioactively inert, and even the missiles themselves would just sputter around and wouldn't even fly a straight trajectory anymore. Right during the same time that all of these nuclear missiles were literally melted down inside the warhead, we also have this amazing formation appear on a dry lake bed in Oregon. The Idaho National Guard has a huge mystery on its hands, and that is our top story today. During routine photo reconnaissance missions over Oregon, RF-4 jets spotted and took photographs of a huge carving in the desert over a thousand feet across. It has everybody talking. I mean, it, this is just something that, well, the children, I was in the group, it's, it's incredibly time consuming. Uh, a lot of expertise involved has taken a long period of time and maybe a lot of money. From point to point is exactly 11 and a half degrees. Exactly. exactly. And, the, and the other one, they're exactly 23 degrees apart. Exactly. No, no variation. No variation. And there's something else puzzling here, something you do not see. You do not see tire tracks, the kind of tracks that might be made by a tractor or a plow. No tire tracks and no footprints. In Oregon, I'm Walden Kirsch for NBC News. The reality is 